Right, let's find out what's happening in Daisy's Double D's on this Monday afternoon. What you got for us, Daisy? Okay, firstly, I want to ask you, why is it that, is it always at the US Open that the men's final is played on Monday? No, it is only the last couple of years, funnily enough, and I don't know the reason for that. But it is America, so they always want to be a bit different. Different, exactly. Mm. Okay, tonight, Kane, Ishikari, and Marin Trilittle battled out at Flushing Meadows to claim the US Open men's title. I've got a couple of facts about the two players who will be playing tonight. There have been 39 Grand Slam finals since Marit Safin beat Leighton Hewitt at the Australian Open in 2005. Every single one of those deciders has featured Rafael Nadal, Roger Federer, or Novak Djokovic. But that incredible streak will end tonight. It's incredible, Anna. That's crazy. It shows the dominance 59, of those three players. 59 Grand Slams that have had those three in. It's like 10 years. Sure. Unbelievable. Okay, the first fact is um, Nishikari is Asia's first male finalist. Nishikari's run to the semifinals was impressive, but he's the first Japanese player to reach that stage of a Grand Slam since who, Sash, in 1933? First Asian. Yeah. I have no idea in 1933. Jiro Sato. Don't know him. And he's taken it a step further. No man playing for an Asian country, full stop, has made it to the final before today. Phenomenal. Cilic was banned over doping. Um, the Croatian didn't play at last year's US Open because he was serving a four-month suspension after testing positive for a banned stimulant called nicotimide something mm. like that. Cilic said he ingested the substance unintentionally without knowing it. Uh, that it was an ingredient in a glucose tablet. He felt the suspension was unfair, but used the time off to improve his game. Cool. And he's massive. He's massive. And that serve. Yeah. No, he's, he's going to be big. Nishikari has become a giant killer overnight. Throughout the first seven seasons of his career, Nishikari only won nine matches against opponents ranked inside the world's top ten. This year alone, he's beaten Novak Djokovic, Roger Federer, Stan Wawrinka, Milos Raonic, and David Ferrer twice. Those are big scalps. I, I love this fact. It's a bit, lo a bit of a battle in the stands as well as on the court. Both finalists have employed former legendary players to help them. Who are they, Sasha? Kane Ishikori is coached by Michael Chang. Yes. And Maron Cilic is... Dana. Goran Ivanizic. Goran! Oh, I love Goran. And they're both oh, pretty passionate when you yeah, see them up yeah. in Sorry. watching. Sorry, Kay, you're a nice guy, but I like Goran more than Michael. Wasn't he? He won Wimbledon and he, he went ballistic. Listen, he lost three so Wimbledons many. or three or four Wimbledons. And then he came, you remember, he retired and he got a, a, a wild, wild card. Wild card, yes. And he won Wimbledon and it was just insane. It Didn't was he just also used to have a bit of a temper on him? Goran? Yeah. A little bit. <laughs> But, man, what a player. What a player. Oh, my goodness. Love him. Big, big left hand, a big serve. Amazing tennis player. Okay, Nishikari actually almost missed the U.S. Open this year. According to the Washington Post, Nishikari underwent surgery to remove a cyst in his right foot last month, and he considered skipping the U.S. Open. Mm -hmm. The first time two players will make their debut in the final of a Grand Slam. It's the first time this will happen since 2005. The last time two players reached their first final at the same Grand Slam. Who were they? Wait, say that again. Okay, it's the first time that two players will make their debut in the final of a Grand Slam since 2005. Yeah. The last time two players reached their first uh, final at the same Grand Slam was in 2005. And who were they? 2000, so we're going back nine years... Oh, brain engage. <laughs> no, help me. Rafael Nadal. Wow. And then a guy by the name of Mariano Porta or Puerta. She was. Yeah, and they went on to say, look at Nadal where he is today, and I don't even know uh, who Puerta exactly. is. Exactly. She was. And then finishing off the betting odds. This uh, is where someone's going to make some cash. Uh, yeah, well, apparently, according to news.com.au, initially the TAB didn't even bother to offer a price for a Nishikari Chilich matchup in the final. But if it had, the odds would have been about 5,000 to 1. Jeez, 5,000 to 1. Absolutely crazy. Brilliant, brilliant. Yeah, I must say, I'm very excited for tonight's final. And it's nice to see fresh new faces there. I was obviously wanting the Fed to get through. Yeah. Because I'm a massive fan. But No, but I think it is cool. I mean, the way that Nishikori played and he beat uh, 
um, Gor- um, Novak. And you sat and went, oh, you, you, you just, in my bones, I just said, uh, there's another upset coming. Chilich is going to yeah, beat Federer. I also had a feeling. Because I sat there and I went, oh, this is ideal. Federer can get his 18th. And mm-hmm. I went, ah, you're playing Marin Chilich. Mm, not so easy. But I'm a massive Brilliant. Federer fan. And then when Nishikari beat Djokovic, I didn't know where like my heart would lie because I want Federer to get the 18th. But then I thought... This Nishikari, what? Oh my goodness, for him to make a final. Well, there we go. Let's hope they don't um, they don't choke. Mm. That's the big one this evening. Um, although, I mean, Chilich has beaten some big, big names, and Nishikari is is. I mean, look at what his record is this this year. Yeah, it's incredible. And he's the fifth highest male or paid male tennis player in the world. After I know what for this year, yeah, from 20 June of 2013 to June of 2014. And to be honest with you, I hadn't really heard about him until I'm just trying to think of he must have made a lot of quarterfinals. And it said that he, um, I don't know, he's got a lot of big brands back, maybe he's got exactly the Japanese brands looking after him. Mm. Fantastic stuff! It is the US Open final tonight, Noshikori versus Marin Cilic.